I greet everybody. Welcome back to Alexo HQ. Today is 16th day of April 2023. So they talk to us. So, Marzin Simon, Epa, Briafa Prime Minister, and Elsai call for the release of Marzin Nam the Kano. Even issue a memo to the European International everybody to set Marzin Nam the Kano free. Because, according to him, see, this Nigeria government are playing the Afghanistan template. So, what come interest me is that as Sam Weber called for this seat, this is the release of Mazin and the Kano, the uh, Imam Powerful also still call for release of Mazi Nam the Kano. These are the kind of things eh, we eh, they like for this struggle. Safeto and Asi, but the reason I'm talking about Barbara is because of Mazi Nam the Kano. That is why. Now, so they talk to Nasu. As Samuel Eba called Prime Minister Braffa and Elzai called for the release of Mazina de Kano. This Emma Powerful that is from the DOS camp still call for the release of Mazina de Kano. It's a very good move. That is what I did like for this struggle. Even you guys don't come together, but you work on to achieve the same goal. It's a very pass mark. Some of them go through the ones with me that say the come from a man powerful as release him on the canon to avoid doomsday I pump once body government as leaders at the authority so I report and they give us this one so I pop said that the unconditional release of Nam the canon as a court and other we avoid uh, doomsday the Indian Port Briafa IPOP on Saturday again won the President Mohamed Dubai led Nigeria government to release his detained leader Nam the Kano to avoid unforeseen circumstances. The IPOP said that the unconditional release of Nam the Kano as a court had heard that we avoid doomsday. So a reporter had earlier reported that Buhari's government through its security agency in collaboration with the Kenya government arrested a rendition Nam IPOP leader to Nigeria in June 2021. Although the Nigeria government had not officially disclosed where it arrested Kano from, both federal and high court and court of appeal have in separate judgment declared its arrest and extraordinary rendition as illegal. The court further banned any court in Nigeria from trying court. It also ordered the government to release him and pay him reparation and infringement of the of his fundamental human right. Also the United Nations Working Group on Ability Detention had also found the arrest and detention of Kanu by Buhari's government as illegal and gave the government six months to release him and pay him adequate compensation. The UN Commission has since been ignored and the six months period at a last. Meanwhile, the federal government has filed appeal at the Supreme Court against the judgment of appeal court, but the appeal has since been stilled after the government got appeal court to steal the executement of its judgment. Recently, there have been reports that Carlos Earth is fast deteriorating. On Friday, it was said to have been vomiting and losing weight last week. It was reported that he was being treated of eye problem and facilitate of the Department of the State, DSS, where he was being held in solidarity confinement. Following the, the detonating condition of Kano, I pop in statement Saturday, issued by a spokesman in my powerful said it will be in the interest of the Nigeria and Nigeria government that Kano did not die in detention. I pop, however, insisted that this involved in torturing Kano using the instrument of injustice and accusation will not break its resolve on Biafra project. A statement by Ima Powerful reads, The global family and movement of indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, under the command of our indomitable leader, 
Amazi Namdikano once again publicly raised alarm on the deteriorating health condition of our leader in the DSS to lightly confirm it. We therefore again and again demand his unconditional release per the order of court so that he can get proper medical examination and uh, treatment. Those involved in torturing Mazina the Kano using the instrument of injustice and coalition will not break its resolve, no IPOP resolve to demand for Brafa independent, not now, not tomorrow, and not ever. The Nigerian government and its supporters should understand that Mazi Namdikano is a living legend that Biafra will not trade with anything in this world. Release Mazi Namdikano unconditionally as the court have ordered to avoid doomsday. A stick in time, save time. So this is coming from uh, in my power. Someone takes some comment for go to Mazi Samuel Biafra Prime saying, as I I strongly doubt this kind of trade will help the matter. On that basis, yeah, this was seen in a human rights defender. Empty trade from uh, featherweight groups is kind of still on YouTube making trade and abusing everyone. Nigeria, I don't know what they have to do. So the federal government, the issue trade, but anyway, from his Twitter space, but we go deal with them with the Igbo people, the language they understand. So now I don't see another person called again, say, Holy truth. Oh, nah. Don't invite Python, make it come dance again. Mm. Okay, let's go to because we have a lot of negative energy in the comment section, which I think some people are still sleeping. Whether they are happy with the way the Nigerian government they treat their apart from Mazi Nambi Kano, you yourself as in Nigeria, do you happy the way the government is treating you we're not talking about Mazina the canal about you as an individual are you happy with it tell yourself the truth we are not going to like a dancers so this breaking the brava republic government in exile through the office of the prime minister has sent memo to the european union calling for support for the release of Mazina the canal and for brava referendum as the only solution for lasting peace to avoid the repeat of afghanistan you see, with the only solution we say shot now, now be this one. So, what we just need is release Mazina the Kano, conduct a referendum. If Briafa, if Briafa, uh, so for those who go through the memo, you can go to Mazisa Meba Twitter space, you go through the memo, the everything day for a year on the, you know, they say, yes, so, uh -huh. so everything is here. So, my own concern is that. If the Nigeria government truly believes in Biafra, they make noise, they are, they are terrorist group, they are this, they are that, what they should do for the masses, what they should do for the world to count on them and left Biafra behind is to officially conduct a referendum with that stupid sense of what they talk about, what they say what happened very soon, so maybe they come out that sense of the referendum. Anybody that decides to stay in Nigeria should stay. Who won't go with Biafra should go with Biafra. So we we'll see, let's say majority wins the vote. So after that one, so we we'll go know who they talk to and who they lie. So I agree with Prime Minister Andre Pisa, referendum is early in the and the race of Magna and Kano is paramount. Now they argue down. So my like video, comment, subscribe, share to all social media platforms. First time they come across our channel, those who subscribe before you jump out of this video. All of my people move.